Hi there, my name's Vince from MyMateVince.com and in this video today I'm going to show you the Xbox wireless adapter for Windows. Now you would use one of these if you're streaming to your Windows 10 device and you don't want to be tethered to it via a USB cable so you want to use it wirelessly. Now with this adapter you can connect up to 8 Xbox One controllers. If you're using your chat headset then you can just connect 4 of these and if you've got the stereo headset then you can only connect two of these. So in the box you get the actual adapter itself and the adapter's got a little bind button just up the top there and you use that to sync your controller to this and also in the back you have a little USB cable that's just a male to female and the idea of this cable is if for example on your desktop if your USB ports, the spare USB ports are at the back then you would use this cable to bring this round to the front because you need to be able to access this button to bind up your controllers and also you have a better connection if this is closer to your controllers. If you can plug this little adapter into any USB 2 or 3 port on your desktop, laptop or tablet. Right, so let's plug it in. I've got two spare ports here on the side so I'm going to plug it in there and to sync up the controller all you need to do is press and hold this bind button here and what I will say is on Windows 10 the drivers are automatically installed in Windows 10 this here will also work with Windows 8.1 and Win Windows 7 but you may need to download the drivers for it but on Windows 10 you will just plug it in and it will work so press and hold the bind button and then that light will start flashing there and then turn on your controller and just like your Xbox One, hit the bind button up the top here and then that will bind, so there we go, that's binded already to that one and then on this controller here again, press and hold the bind button turn your controller on and press and hold the bind button there and there we go, that's connected now so if we go to here Right, it says please reconnect controller, so just press A, and as you can see now, it's now working. Okay, so that's nice and easy. It will also work with other PC games as well. So if you've got, for example, like a, a Steam account, then you can connect up your Xbox One controller to that. Now, it won't work if you've got your old Xbox 360 controller. So for example, if I turn that one on, and then if I press the bind button down here, and then if I press the bind button up the top here, unfortunately, they don't sync up. So will, this little adapter here will only work with Xbox One controllers. Right, okay, hopefully you found that useful. Please subscribe for more how-to videos. Please give it a thumbs up if it helped you. Take care, thank you, bye now.